Good morning. Today we are going to see how to build a VPN side to side between Palo Alto and uh, AWS. So it's very easy. Look this. Um, this is still uh, uh, my lab. Then it will be changed soon because um, related to mes the message I posted on uh, LinkedIn and here on YouTube. I will going to show you how to um, build the VPN side to side with AWS, but with no downtime when the firewall the firewall switch over and then have to rebuild the tunnel and BGP uh, neighborship uh, again. But this is another story, and uh, I will show you on the next video. So uh, anyway. In this case, uh, only this uh, firewall is on, of course, panorama, uh, the switch, uh, and, uh, and the traffic to internet with uh, be behind, uh, behind the NAT. For do this, uh, um, if you want to do it, you have to open on your firewall this port, UDP 500 and UDP uh, 400, um, 4,500. So, okay. Now, let's check um, AWS. Of course, the VPN here, it's already built, but I show you anyway how to do it because um, I can show you. You see, tunnel is up and everything is up, but no worries, no worries. So, first of all, you need to create uh, your uh, uh, VPC under uh, virtual private cloud. Um, this one is not mandatory, to be honest. In this case, it's, it's just for uh, uh, the future test, because this one you need when uh, you build your own uh, VM, for example, on cloud. Otherwise, it works anyway. This is up to you. I'm show you how I did. So you need to go here, uh, your VPC, create VPC. I just created two subnet, but you can create one or more than, than one, up to you. And you give a name, like a subnet, for example, 03. Then here you need to specify the IP address, then the, 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 the network. So the network ID uh, 2.0 slash 24, for example, and create a VPC. Again, VPC and you will see here my subnet one two and three so at this point you have to go scroll down scroll down here custom customer gateway and you have to create one uh, in this case as i said there is already one but uh, you can i'm going to create another one so create on the just a second on the um, top right, click uh, Create a Custom Gateway. You have to give uh, the name, of course, uh, Custom Gateway 02. Or you can call any name you wish. BGP ASN, you need to find the, the free number. Um, for example, you can use, if you want, uh, uh, this number here. 64,000, uh, this one, for this one is the first available and the priva private uh, ESN then we can use. Uh, this one is already in use in my network, so uh, I should put this one, uh, actually 14. Then uh, here you need to type your, um, your public IP. Well, to be more precise, the public IP of the other site. In this case, will be my public IP. If you need to find your public IP, my IP, of course. And uh, this is my public IP. Just copy and uh, paste here. Oops. It's not actually copied. Copy. So the rest can you can leave uh, everything like this. You don't need to add anything else. So and create a, your gateway. Mm -hmm. 
now let me check yeah okay then so at this point go to here virtual private gateway and you have to create your virtual private gateway so give a name like a virtual uh, gateway custom as number this one will be like before 6451 6451 uh, 4 uh, sorry 5 because this one will be the other side and create this one called 03 create another one uh is actually is uh, let me see is it just remove the other one yeah okay then uh okay no problem so at this point you select this one go here actions actions and attach to vpc if you scroll down you have your subnet one two three and just add one subnet because i don't need one uh okay then give a, uh, in this case um, i have to add the three it's a strange because um, um hmm. okay and you see here state attaching okay in the main uh, in the meantime he's attaching uh, the subnet scroll down and click site to site vpn connections even in this case i have another the tunnel already done of course so you have to create a new vpn connection just click create vpn connection top right give a name then uh, vpn 0007 this one a virtual private gateway or transit gateway or not associated so it's a virtual private gateway uh, in this case you have to select your uh, virtual gateway in my case it's a 01 i'm going to select the 03 just for the test i'm not going to create another one but uh, just for show you customer gateway new here again you have to uh, um, copy and paste your public ip then this one empty this one will be the uh, the remote uh, as in this case is actually minus 13 uh, let me see just for confirmation but I think so just let me see here vgp 13 yeah and uh, here if you have uh, in this case if you're using uh, a bgp you just leave like this bgp otherwise it's static and then you have to fill up this one so the static ip prefix etc cancel then when it's done the only things you have to do on top download configuration and then here we have to you have to choose your firewall for example cisco then uh, you see asa 5500 etc etc or in my case palo alto so pa series okay so basically if you choose the first one and the last one you have the configuration already done so technically it's just a copy and paste copy and paste on the console of palo alto or otherwise you choose a gui like i did and download when uh, uh, you download the file it will be like this you receive this file for a configuration of first tunnel and the configuration of the uh, second tunnel so basically this one is how to set the vpn site to site to 
AWS. So it's very, very easy. And um, under network, of course, uh, virtual router, IPsec tunnel, you will see the VPN tunnel is up. So for me, it works. Um, for today, it's everything. Thank you for watching. Uh, leave a like uh, if the video is helpful for you. Subscribe to my channel, etc., 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 as usual, because uh, I try to, to grow up with my channel. Thank you.